In this English lesson, I wanted to help you learn the English phrase, come in handy. When we say that something might come in handy in English, it means that it is something that might be useful. A great example of this would be if you are traveling to a country like Canada, and if you brought some Canadian money, it might come in handy. That means that even though you'll probably pay for most things with your phone or with a credit card, having some cash might come in handy. It might be very, very useful to have some actual Canadian currency with you. So when you say that it might come in handy, it means that it might be useful. Um, sometimes when I go to the grocery store, I bring a few grocery bags with. We have reusable grocery bags and they always come in handy when I need to pack my groceries into the bag in order to carry them home. So when something comes in handy, it means that it is useful and helpful for what you are doing. Um, the second phrase I wanted to help you learn today is the phrase handy dandy. And I thought this was an old phrase that people didn't use very often anymore, but it is a way to describe something that is useful. Um, when you need to bang a nail into a piece of wood, um, a hammer can be can be quite handy. Um, and you can say that you are using your handy dandy hammer. Um, so it is a way to describe something that is useful. Um, when I go outside to make my videos, I use my handy dandy phone and my handy dandy microphone. Um, so it's simply a fun way to describe something that is useful or handy. And again, I thought it was an old phrase uh, because I don't use it much, but I looked it up on Google and it's actually a phrase that's used quite often. So I'm glad I have my handy dandy phone and my handy dandy microphone so that I can make English lessons for all of you. Have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow with another short English video.